Good morning, Cougars. I'm Emerson Asby. And I'm Donna Cordova. Today is Thursday, October 20th. This is Principal's Month. Did you know that our principal, Ms. Sherman, was a kindergarten teacher before she became a principal? Did you know that she loves to sing and that she plays the piano extremely well? Did you know that she believes in each and every student here at Northeast Elementary and wants you to do your best every day? All of these things are true and only part of what makes Ms. Sherman such a wonderful principal. Today, let's give a hearty salute to Ms. Sherman all together. One, two, three. Salute! Our inspirational quote for the day comes from Herman Mead. It is better to fail in originality than to succeed in imitation. Happy birthday to Miss De Delphine Barrow in Down Cafeteria. We hope you have a wonderful day. Our lunch menu for today is roast turkey with dressing and gravy or corn dogs, sweet potatoes, collard greens, and fruit. This October, join schools, child care centers, and organizations across North Carolina in, in celebrating National Farm to School Month by crunching into locally grown apples. Participants of all ages are invited to crunch with us. Across North Carolina, kids and adults will be crunching an apple grown on a local farm in October. In addition to commemorating National Farm to School and Early Child Care and Education Month, this annual event celebrates North Carolina agriculture, local farmers and farm workers, and nutrition. The North Carolina Crunch promotes healthy eating and supports farm to school and other local food purchases, purchasing invitations throughout the state. It also is a fun way to connect food and agriculture to all kinds of classroom curricula, from science to art. So grab an apple and start crunching. This Friday is picture, picture makeup day. This is only for students who were not here on the original picture day, new students and staff, and students who were dissatisfied with their pictures. Teachers, please refer to the students sent by Ms. Paws on Tuesday. Early voting for the midterms election begins today, October 20th. Midterm elections fall between presidential elections and are often seen as checks on how the country feels about the current administration is doing. Many very important state and local elections are being held the, during the midterm election time. Each of us has a duty as citizens of the United States to let our voices be heard. If you are old enough to vote in this election, we hope that you will head to the polls over the next few days or on election day. If you are not old enough to vote, we hope that you will encourage the eligible people in your household to vote. It is so important. Election day itself is November 8th. On this day in history, October 20th, 1803, the U.S. Senate, after due constant consideration and considerable oratory, ratified the Louisiana Purchase. October 20th is also known as National Chicken and Waffles Day. Young. Eighth grade football and volleyball players need to return their sheets for eighth grade recognition to Ms. Simmons. Ms. Rouse's math students need to put homework in the respective homework folder at the back of their homeroom class. If you do not place it in the folder, it will not be graded and thus a zero will be for the grade. Attention middle school, school students interested in joining National Junior Beta Club. Invitations will go out after the first record card. Keep your grades up and have a good attitude. You need all A's and B's and S on conduct. Remember to check out the Pinewood Dirt Derby and Chicken Dinner Flyer from Pack 341. This event will this the event is this Saturday. Miss Vaughn has posted the flyer on her announcement email for the teachers to give information to interested students. Please let your teacher know if you need more information. Arts on the Fungo's Haunted House on Main Street in Belhaven starts this weekend, October 21st and 22nd. It will also be open next weekend, October 28th and 29th. The house will be open from 6 to 9.30 p.m. The tickets are $4, and the haunted house is not recommended for children under 12 without a legal guardian. Are you ready? You only have eight days. Eight days! Eight days to prepare for this year's Trunk or Treat. It is returning this year on Friday, October 28th, from 6 to 8 p.m. We here in the morning announcement broadcast room are becoming more excited about Trunk or Treat every day. We'll be trying to inspire you to wear your best costume by showing you some of our. We love your feedback. Now please stand for a moment of silence.
Please remain standing for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Cougars. Let's make it a great day and don't forget to roar. Roar.